Yo, what's going on? In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to get rid of your bounty in Red Dead Redemption 2. And I'm going to be showing you two different ways to do it. You can either pay it off or you can surrender to the law and basically get it gone for free. So stay tuned. It's been a cold winter and it's lasted far too long. If you want to join a community of mature PS4 gamers so you can play with other mature gamers like yourself and me, then go to patreon.com forward slash jcarterray to find out more information and join today. I will see you there. Yo, what's going on? I'm Jay Carter Ray from GrowOnYouTube.com teaching you how to be better. And to get rid of your bounty, there are two ways to do it. The first way is to pay it off, but that's probably not going to be the most efficient way to play the game if you just keep on paying off your bounty. Because there was one point where I did a robbery and I made like $50 and my bounty after that robbery was $50 as well. So I do not recommend just paying off every bounty you get because that may be terrible. But in order to do that, what you need to do is go to the post office. Here is the post office on the map. This is the post office in St. Denis. But if you want to find the post office wherever you are, you can press square and you can basically go down the map and go to the post office and you'll be able to see all the different post offices on the map there's generally well i just went to saloon by accident here's post office there's generally a post office in every city and there's usually multiple post offices around that city so in order to pay off the bounty you need to go to the post office go to the clerk press l2 and press circle to pay that bounty and here you can pay your bounty in the different states because you do a crew different bounties in different states so for example we can pay off our bounty in new hanover and just we can pay all of them actually let's just pay all of them we'll press square to pay all and now we have no bounties anywhere and that is lovely for us but we did incur a very big loss doing that and i don't suggest it the next way to get rid of your bounty without paying all the money is to surrender now before you surrender if you want to save your money you need to donate all your funds to your camp so go to your camp i will show you the map right about now your camp is always on the map with whatever it's called it looks like this it's kind of like a what do i call it it looks like a flask it looks like a flask you go to your camp you go to the contrib contribution box if you don't already know about that let me know in the comment section down below and i will make a video on that if need be but you know it's it's a big part of the game you should know about it go to the contribution box and donate all your funds then you can surrender by going to a lawman you press L2 on them. If they don't recognize you, press L2, then press circle to antagonize them. And then you need to press circle again to antagonize them again. And then they'll get angry with you and you'll be wanted at that point. And at that point, you can press L2 and then press triangle to surrender to the lawman. Now, if you don't donate all your money, then going to jail will take a percentage of your earnings now it doesn't seem like it's the same time every time because i did this twice the first time they took 200 dollars and my bounty was 250 and the second time they took 160 dollars and my bounty was still 250 so it can vary but that is a lot of money but i did have like over a grand so they take a percentage of your earnings it's quite large you want to donate all your money beforehand and then just buy stuff for the camp but i guess if you got like three grand maybe you don't want to donate it then you just run away from bounty hunters for the rest of your life like i do really but i hope this video helped you out gave you two options to get rid of that bounty you can do it for free by donating all your money and keeping your money in the camp funds and then going to jail and when you go to jail and come out of jail you will have all your bounty gone as you can see on the map here do not start shooting if you want to surrender because as soon as you take your gun out and start shooting people they will shoot you back like the lawmen will just shoot you they won't give you the opportunity to surrender so make sure you just antagonize them don't go around just shooting people because that is not going to work out in your favor 
Thanks for watching and liking and subscribing. If you have any questions or any other tutorials you'd like me to make, please leave those in the comment section down below. Also, if you're thinking about getting this game, but you're not sure if it's right for you, then my review on it will be in the description of this video when it's out. So you can check that out and see if it's worth the price for you. It's been a cold winter and it's lasted far too long. So all this warmth I share with you